In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you guys how to add bullet points and get them to be formatted just the way that you like them in Adobe InDesign. So I've just used the type tool, clicked and dragged to draw a text box and started a little header text called, this is my list. Now underneath this, if I want a couple of bullet points, let's say I'm just typing here, anything I want, one, two, three, four. If I want these to be a bulleted list, there's a couple places you can find it. This top toolbar, if you don't have it, it's called control and you can go up to window and show it by checking control. In the right hand side of the character section of control, if your screen allows, you'll find the bulleted list. Also in the properties panel, if you're updated in InDesign and only see properties, you can scroll down and find bullets and numbering down here, same thing. Now the last place and probably the place that you should know is underneath the type dropdown. If we go down to bulleted and numbered lists, we can apply bullets or apply numbers right here. So let's go ahead and apply bullets to these four little bullet points. Once we've done that, we can select them all and then get to the bulleted list options. To do that, you're gonna hold option or alt and click on this thumbnail of the bulleted list, whether you found it down here in properties or up here in your control panel. You have this dialog box open now and you can adjust the list type from none to bullets to numbers and you can also adjust the character or symbol that your bullet is and you can add them from your glyphs panel right here. Also make sure you check preview to see all the different changes. Then on bullet and number position, depending on how far out your tabs are, the space between the bullet and the actual text, you can adjust that here whether it's center, left aligned, whatnot, and then you can change the left indent. And just like this, we can change how far our indentation is of our bulleted list. And we can also adjust how close that bullet is or the first line of our bullet point to the actual bullet itself. Once you get that looking the way you want it, you can hit okay. You can swap this to a numbered list just by clicking on the numbers and bullets and numbering and vice versa. So that is how you add bullet points here in Adobe InDesign.